Well, a very warm welcome to you on this most pleasantly clear evening. Conditions absolutely beautiful. Perfect. Jim, how are you reading the formation? Well, a system promoted by the rise of total football, Peter. The wider players in the front three are, are key operators in how it all works on and off the ball. They have to provide for the central striker, of course, and protect their fullback, so they'll get few breathers. If these two don't make a good impression, there are quite good replacements on the bench. So that's got things underway. Tries to locate someone up front. Sprayed out wide, lovely feet. Dinks one in. Shooting chance! That's caused a worry or two. Good effort, very good effort. He would have at least wanted to make the keeper work, though. it back and the finish oh shame that was nicely worked that was created because of good lively movement which pretty much dictated the pass Canales floats one over. What a throw in. A buccaneering run from the defender. And through to the goalkeeper. And the counter is on. Has gone out. Canales, hit long and direct, Hector Bellerin, this could fall anywhere, a wonderful effort all by himself. Well the run was really impressive, the finish was depressive and expectations were not met. That's not going far. And that's a throw in. Things have been frenetic in the early part of this game. A lot of action high up the pitch. Carvalho. And here's Juan Mi. Canales. Yeah, he was under pressure to get that exactly right, and he couldn't even think of the consequences. It was instinctive and rock solid. He's through, now is he in? And the shot! He's scored! And that really is so, so impressive. Oh, look, it's always great to see a solo effort with a goal. It's the ideal combination of pace and control.
A 1-0 lead established. Still a fragile lead, though. They can't afford to sit on this. Canales takes it out to the wing. And here's Juan Mi. Juan Mi. He's got options in the box if he gets his head up. Oh, he's found him in space. Cleared without complication. Luis goes up and over. Good challenge, he just stood firm. He's picked him out, gets the better of his man. Real Betis have pushed both fullbacks into quite advanced positions here. Yeah, that's that's interesting. So what are they attempting to do? Well, it's it's a bold attempt, in my opinion, to occupy the opposition in a way they're not expecting. Canales. And it's Juanmi. Out to the left it goes. Canales. A pop. It's a carbon copy of the previous miss. Real Betis really are in the ascendancy here, and they know they have to register while that's the case. Promising move that good inroads into enemy territory, but no joy. Has a hit! Oh, that is rather wayward. Celtic were again presented with an opportunity to break and look very, very threatening. Joaquin. Barry. And here's Joaquin. Oh, sweet feet. Hector Bellerin. Oh, here's over the line. Just brushed off the ball there. It's loose. Who's getting there? Here's Juan Mi, goes for goal, it's in! Real Betis back on level terms! A momentary lapse exploited with glee. That has added a whole new complexion to the game. Look, get your seatbelts on because this is showing all the signs of another roller coaster ride. Kings it out wide. Plenty waiting in the middle. Now the counter. Juan Mi tries to get it forward quickly. Oh, super tackle. They were outnumbered and under the cosh. That had to be spot on, and it was. That's a pop! Oh, he's really drilled it. I actually like to see that in shots at goal when there's a, a noticeable effort to get over the ball and, and keep it down.
hoists it forward. And they've got it back as soon as they gave it away. Danger averted for now. And that'll be the last act of the first half. So, a very watchable game so far. Action at both ends and the team's level. The will come for the break with nothing to separate them. The score, 1-1. We're probably into the second 45 minutes. And it's played forward. For a moment, you felt that was going somewhere, but they'll have to go again. Juan Miranda. Juan Miranda goes looking. Let's put a stop to that. And he's got the ball glued to his feet. Out to the right, now a chance to break. Forward it goes. Well, it seems as if he's just had a momentary lapse and, and slipped into tunnel vision because he had good options around him and he failed to get his head up. Plays it out to the flank. Oh, that is lovely footwork. forward at pace it's a decent ball what? Joaquin oh denied brilliantly well that was high class goalkeeping there to back up his, his high class range and it's Carvalho it is good for it And the comeback is complete. Real Betis are really pouncing on any straight passes in midfield. We're talking seconds from interception to the back of the net. It's counter-attacking heaven. Real Betis get themselves into the lead. Yeah, for me, this team seems to find it easier to attack than defend, but now they're going to need to dig in at the back a bit. Balls out on the left now. Delivers a cross. Great leap! And oh, he's got that completely wrong. All he'd be thinking is, please, ground, swallow me up. Towards the front men, Bartra gets into the right position to intercept. Canales. Joaquin. Juan Miranda. Tries lifting it over. Hart can pick that up. Gone a long way up and away. Oh, 
Oh, really good feet from him. Looking to break out here. He's picked him out. Surely a foul free kick. Well, you might think he got off lightly. It is just a verbal warning. Betis are looking to make this one safe. They want to reduce the risk. Goes direct to the front line. Ruiz plays it forward. Oh, he's broken through. Over to the left. Time to deliver. Oh, that's nice. Carvalho. Foul and a free kick in a very dangerous area. And that's going to be a booking. Had a crack. We all love a trier, Peter, but the wiser choice would have been ball into box. Tries to stroke it through. Celtic have a simple task to find something sustained now and keep the pressure on. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. Played out to the right. And it's Joaquin. And here's Canales. Now it's Juanmi. Shapes to shoot! Oh, the keeper's done ever so well. Oh, that's a sparkling save. Absolutely sparkling. His reflexes were ultra sharp. Some movement on the bench, and we are going to see a change. Yeah, it's pretty obvious as to who was going to be taken off. His energy levels began to, to sag, and he was never going to last until the final whistle. Real Betis certainly don't need to overcommit now. Their priority lies further back. The ball needed to be better there. It's a wasted chance. William Carvalho has created one goal already. Hector Bellerin. So that's it. It is all over. Quite a game. Memorable for its fluctuation in fortunes and astonishing turnaround. But what are your thoughts on today's game then, Jim? It can be difficult at times playing in front of your own fans if you're